What I'm going to do is I'm going to leave the camera outside in the cold. Hello folks, welcome to NetCruiser Tech. I'm shooting on the GoPro Hero 7 Black with firmware 1.70. It's daytime, mid-afternoon on a very cold day. It is minus 20 degrees Celsius out right now. And I just brought this camera out from the house. So it's warm, it was plus 20 plus degrees in the house. Now it's just hit minus 20 in the last 20 seconds. I'm going to make a few little clips here. I'm gonna shoot some clips, just walking around because at this point, HyperSmooth should be working. Uh, it's on 2.7K60, hyper smooth is enabled. And I'm going to walk around for maybe one minute. And then I'm going, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave the camera outside in the cold. Uh, and then come back in five to ten minutes and I'll start up the camera again and we'll do this similar sequence and see did hyper smooth turn off? Or did it actually give me the, the error on the screen or the message on the screen where it tells me the HyperSmooth is being disabled from temperature? Because that's apparently a new feature. And I haven't seen it happen yet. Now the screen just turned off. But, I mean, yeah. So we've been shooting for, it's very bright. We've been shooting for over one minute, one minute, 15 seconds. Maybe I'll take it just to two minutes just to give it... Make sure that it actually gets a good shot. So I'm just gonna walk around. This is mostly a stabilization test because the camera should be warm enough right now where hyper smooth, hyper smooth is working. <clears throat> so it was one minute and 30 second clip. We'll take it for another 30 seconds and then I'll shut it off. I'll let the camera sit outside in the cold and then we'll come back. Okay, this camera has now been outside for approximately 20 minutes. It's so cold that it's cold to the touch as well as the LCD screen on the front of the display is going really slow. <coughs> so let's see if HyperSmooth is actually... Okay, that was a bit of a fail. The battery that was sitting outside for 20 minutes completely died within 10 seconds. I went and grabbed another battery so the camera itself is still freezing cold, but it's got a warm battery in it. So we're gonna see how does that affect things. Is it a battery performance related issue that they get they get really bad in the cold? But is it is it that the processor, I don't understand why the processor would care if it's cold in the GoPro. That shouldn't affect HyperSmooth, but who knows? So I've been recording for 37 seconds on this battery. So, so far my testing has been that yes, the cold greatly affects the battery capacity, but that happens on every lithium battery. If you try and run them when they're cold, it's, it's no go. Like they just, they just quit out on you. So that's been recording for an hour, an hour, one minute. That's one minute just now. It's gonna walk back here. This should still be doing hyper smooth. And as for a message on the screen, there's been no message on the screen to tell me that it's going to stop stabilization. So I don't know what they mean by that. What is it doing? Why are they saying it's going to stop stabilization? The release notes for this new firmware say that it has improved notifications in cold weather use. Well, I haven't seen any notifications yet and I got the camera so cold that the battery wouldn't even work. So I don't know. Looks like we're going to have to do some more testing long term but if you're someone who's like out on the ski slopes a lot i don't know what you're supposed to do i guess you keep your gopro in your pocket all the time to keep it as warm as possible but i mean you obviously want the stabilization for for when you're skiing but i don't know what you're supposed to do so this battery's holding fine because it was warm when i started using it so i don't know still works when the camera itself is minus 20 maybe that didn't work before I never did run my GoPro when it was this cold when it's this cold I don't want to do anything I'm I'm barely uh, being able to record this four minute video I just want to show you here what happens when your GoPro is very cold so I just brought it in out of minus 20 you'll see that the screen is very slow to refresh it's starting to warm up a bit already now that now that it's been inside it's almost back to full speed now almost the rear lcd screen was working fine but it was the front the front panel that was extremely slow to refresh anyway 
I don't know. I, uh, I've got this so cold that I can barely hold on to it. And I did not get any weird messages about no stabilization. So I'm not sure how you're supposed to get that to happen or when that happens. But so far, the cold just is affecting the battery and not the performance. But maybe that's the whole point of this firmware. I never did get a chance to try it in this cold attempts with the old firmware. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this or you learned something, hit that like button. If you're new around here, subscribe. If you want to talk to me, leave a comment down below. And as always, thanks for watching.